Hi guys, I'm back. <laughs> Neil is back. We're playing out here at Houston National. Today we're gonna do a two-man best ball from 7,400 yards. We're gonna see how low we can go. Our goal is even. Even par, yeah. I mean, I haven't touched the club since the last video, so make sure you check that out. Good contact up the right side. Uh, down in that valley, just short right of the green. 130 yards. Uh, that was a good poke there to get us started. We're both in prime position here. Um, 130 yards, pin is in the front, so you want to make sure you hit at least 130 and get it up there. It is a little elevated, so um, take a little bit extra club here. We call that indecision. That's what indecision will do to you. Being right next to the driving range, we get these nice little uh, lawnmower golf balls. Uh, let's try and get one up there and close. Maybe I should try uh, warming up before my round. That's a little bit better. Settle. All right, well, we have a par putt. Get in there. Oh. All right, bogey start. Hole number two. Um, so the wind is kicking up. It is a, I guess it's a link style course here. It's not a whole lot of trees in the way, lots of rolling fairways and whatnot. So hopefully we get some good run out because I need every ounce of run out I can get. That's piped right down the center. That's what we're looking for. There's water up there, but I think that's about 300 yards out. So we should be in the clear. That was poked well. It's up the right side, but I think that's gonna be optimal. Yep. Yep, good kick down into the fairway. Okay, so we're in decent shape. Zach's about 30 yards ahead of me in the middle of the fairway. See? Oh, great strike. Should be just right of that bunker. Yep, perfect. So this next shot is all over water. It's about 260 to carry. We are downwind, but I would not be able to make it. So I'm gonna try and get us uh, both two wedges into the green. Someone's gotta make a birdie here. Let's go. It's right at the bunker, but it should be short. Yep, that's exactly what we wanted. Uh, got 114 downwind. It is a back pin, so I have some room to work with in front of the flag. right at it oh ah, too much sauce on that brought it off the wrong side of the ledge it's gonna be an interesting putt coming up oh, okay just a little bit hit it Nice par. We needed a birdie there. <laughs> yeah, it's only gonna get harder from here on out. I think that was a really good chance and the next three holes are gonna be really brutal. Oh, it's right at it. Get in the hole so I don't even have to hit. Yeah. While we're at it, give us a like. We're gonna see if we can get this video up to about 50 likes. Never done it before. This could be the first one. Smash that like button. Short par three? No, those none exist here. It's 177 uphill into the wind. Let's see what we can get. I'm going with the trusty old gapper. Ah, pulled it. That's a tug job. Okay. All right, Neil just made it onto the green there. We got a good look at a birdie. I say we, because I'm gonna contribute somewhere along the line, but we'll get there. 
Get in there. Oh. Nice. Whose decision was it to play from the tips? Is that you? Yes. So we got a 453 yard par four. This is a big boy golf hole. Dog leg to the right, which plays perfect for my draw. That's up the left side. That's uh, same vicinity as Neil. I think I'm about 30 yards behind him though. Okay, that's up the left side. Got a long way home, but that's a good poke. Ben, 197, that's another gapper. Just what I wanted. Oh, and, uh, good layup, Zach. Top the shit out of that. All right, we got 73 yards after that topped gapper. I don't always hit it well. Oh, that's gotta go. I lied. Sorry, I lied to all of you. I did not get it there. Oops. All right, here's Neil. Got to kick off the fence here. Little members bounce. It's gonna hit on the other side of the hill and release. He's on the green, got a par putt. Oh. Very nice. Another dog leg right, 430 yards this time. Should be nothing. Uh, into the wind. Uh, to keep it out of the wind, I'm going to try and flight it a little bit lower, still get some run out. Uh, I pulled it. It is straight, but um, it's lengthened the hole considerably. Oh, that's piped. Get up there, just towards the left side of the green. I don't know what it did. We're looking straight into the sun, but I, I think it's no a good idea. spot. All right, 210, coming out of the fluffy stuff, sitting up a little bit, gonna hit a five wood. Boy, we need this. Struck well towards the right side of the green. Okay, we'll see what's up there. Can't really see where it ended up, but that's a good ball. Oh. Par five, dog leg left, slightly to the right then. After that, a little bit of a snake hole. Try to get a birdie. That's probably going to be just fine. Duck, duck, but oh. Up the left side. That's. I don't know. I got to get off the struggle train. You know, shout out to Doc Adams Golf. He, he provided me with this nice, uh, beautiful pink shirt. But I think it's bringing me bad luck. It can't be my golf swing. It's this pink shirt. That's why I'm playing like doo doo. Oh. Well, I striped that one. I think that's uh, going to be optimal position. It's going up the right side. Okay, no, uh, maybe. we're finding maybe. it. We're 282 uh, into the wind. I don't think I can get the three wood there, but I'm gonna give it a go. Oh, it's hit well. It's in a great position to hopefully up and in for birdie. It's in a little thin. Oh yeah, still in a great spot. Keep going towards the hole. All right, we got 58 to the flag. I don't know, I just need to get the ball on the green. Ah, uh, tug job, short, just not good. Get up there. Yeah. All right, on, dude. good kick forward. Oh, come on. Nice bar. Oh. 210 yard par three, straight into the wind. 
Uh, neither of us are long hitters, so we're both taking our long wood, <laughs> three woods here, and see if we can't get up there on the green. Uh, it's trying to drop back over, started out to the right. Okay, should be fine. Oh, it was spanked, but then it turned over on you to the left. Oh, no, that's gone. Well, I said I wanted to contribute, but I don't think I wanted to contribute because Neil pulled his left into the ravine, whatever this junk is. Uh. <laughs> All right, we got to get a birdie here. Uh, 420 yards downwind. Um, grip it and rip it. Pretty open up there. Okay, it's right down the center. Kind of towed it, so it may not have the distance I want, but it's a good ball. That is on a great line as well, right down the middle. One of us has to convert here. 166, try to get to the green, make a putt for birdie. Okay, about pin high, right high. I think I have about 150 to the flag. Oh, and I thinned the piss out of that. <sighs> Just can't make my life easy today. Okay, water right, houses left. Hit the middle. Headed right. I'll see where it ends up. So as long as I keep this one in the middle of the fairway, shouldn't have any problems, but I think that's pretty much any hole you play. Ah, whatever. Well, it's right at him. Uh, I might kill that guy. I don't, I don't know what the distance is here. All I know is that there's a big body of water to the right, so I want to try to keep it away from that. So. Uh, it's roping to the right. Carry. Ooh, splish splash. He's taking a bath. Well, I got about 160. I'm straight into the wind, so I got a club up here. Um, Neil is in the water, so I need to convert here, unlike the last hole. That's hit well. Yeah. All right. I think we're about pin high. Putting for birdie. Don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the bell notifications, follow on the Fringe Golf. Let's get it. Smash that subscribe button. Let's go.